Create learning pods and setting tasks from the resource menu. In this tutorial, we'll cover creating learning pods as well as everything else you can do using the resources menu. Resources is always accessible on the study ladder menu at the top of the page. From the top of the page, you have access to all resources, recently viewed activities, printables, learning packs, as well as study ladders quick links. On the All Resources page, you can filter by subject, grade, and topic to find what you're looking for. All tasks, videos, and activities can be previewed here to ensure that you're happy with the content. You can also play the activities straight from the menu. If you wish to set an activity for your class, we'll need to create a pod. Pods are a collection of tasks, videos, and activities that you can create and customize to curate your students' learning. If you are unfamiliar with pods, we have another video tutorial covering pods and the pod library in depth in our help section. You can create a pod from the resource menu by clicking the add button next to any activity. Doing so will prompt you to either create a new pod or add an activity to a currently existing pod. If we select Add Activities to New Pod, we'll see the activity be added to a pod within the pod editor. Simply give the pod a name and hit Create. Once we've created the pod, we can assign it to a class or group and even schedule when we'd like the pod to be assigned. Once the pod has been created, you can continue to add additional activities by clicking the Add buttons next to the desired activity. The number of students that have already completed any given activity will be displayed below the Add button, if any. If you hover over the icon, it will tell you the average score for that particular activity within the selected class or group. You can add every task within a subtopic by hitting the Add All button on the subtopic header. You can see the name of the current pod that you're editing up at the top of the page as well as the total number of activities currently within. Click the Edit button to bring up the list of activities within the pod. You can also create a new pod or begin editing an existing pod by clicking the Pod Selection button next to the Edit button. If we navigate from the Resources page to the Printable Worksheets menu, we have access to all of the printable resources on StudyLadder. If we select one of the printable collections, we can preview each printable, print them, or even add the collection to a pod. Scroll to the bottom of the page and hit Add Activities to Pod. Create a new pod or add to an existing one, then remove any printables you don't want by hitting the red button next to each. Then, either hit Create Pod or Save Changes depending on whether you're creating a pod or altering an existing one. This method of adding activities en masse is also available within the Teaching Packs menu.